Hey guys, it's Elijah. So I know the last video that I had was too dark, so I decided I was gonna step up the light in this video. I'm not that mean. So I was watching a video by OMG It's Josh talking about his worst day ever. And at the video, he stated that I should make a video response or a text response. Okay, well, he didn't specifically say me. I can use my imagination. Okay, now this guy's gonna think I'm a creep. So my worst day ever took place when I was 11 years old. Maybe I was 12. So I was riding my bike with my neighbor. And I enjoyed hanging out with my neighbor. And I guess if you haven't already noticed, I have a short attention span. So my neighbor was like, hey, look at me. Big mistake. So I kind of crashed into a rock and it launched me on the cement about five to 10 feet. Now, it probably doesn't sound that bad, but in reality, it hurt my arm. And yeah, but the worst part that I probably thought, I know it kind of sounds stupid, but my head hurt more than my arm. So I had a really bloody arm and I had a huge cut on my forehead and a lot of blood was coming out of it, but it was just this cut from my helmet. So I went to the hospital, my parents drove me, and it turned out I fractured my wrist. So yeah, they treat my arm and the next day I got a cast. So then I go to school, I have a cast. I'm like, yes, I am gonna have everyone sign it. No one signed my cast. Turned out the reason why was because I was telling people I broke my wrist by falling off my bike. Hey, what happened to your arm? Oh, I fell off my bike. So I guess after I found out it wasn't cool that I fell off my bike, I decided I was gonna make up a cool story. Oh, I fixed my lighting. So I decided I would tell people I fell out of a tree while saving a koala while the tree was burning. Yeah, so hey, get out of here, you cat. Turns out koalas don't live here. Great. So I guess there's two morals to the story. One, don't wear helmets when riding a bike. It'll scratch your face. And two, unless you live in Australia, koalas are not an excuse. So why is this mounted on my wall?